Hello my viewers, this is the new shed. I just bought this and actually I bought two of these. Uh, this one is uh, going to be uh, coming over to my house here in about two days and I got another one coming. They have to make it. So this is a, uh, a 10 by 12. Um, so it's, uh, you know, big enough really for my shop that I want to build in here. Um, I figure I'm going to use the uh, 12 foot length here for my workbench. And uh, by the way, uh, let's see here. Um, I'm going to do a little measuring here. So, actually, the actual usable space here is going to be 11 feet 5 inches. Okay, um, that's, but that means I'm going to have to cut about 7 inches or so off of the workbench I already have in my garage, which is not real bad. Um, and then this side here, which is 10 feet, I'll be able to build some shelves right in here. Um, I think what I'm going to do up here, but it's got some power, uh, or rather, uh, see EMT and boxes and that, um, I guess going down where it can be, where you can connect power. Um, underneath this shed, but I, I don't know if um, that's really what I want to do. Um, I mean, I might just leave that there for now. Uh, but yeah, what I'll probably do here is use some of the uh, um, aluminum foil. I gotta remember what it's called. Uh, I put a bunch of this up in my attic. Anyway, I'll probably wrap the the top here, the ceiling, with that uh, to keep heat out. And then I'll insulate the sides here, uh, probably with the foam, um, uh, foam block or what do you call it? Uh, anyway, I got to go to Home Depot here and try to get some prices. So what I got to do is first things first so that you know I don't die of sticker shock. What I'm going to do is um, I'm going to go ahead and uh, insulate the uh, side where I'm putting my workbench okay because if I put my workbench there then I'm going to have a hard time uh, insulating it and then I'll also put some of the uh, um, uh, aluminum wrap up here, okay, and and then I'll do uh, the other sides in uh, the uh, uh, foam with the uh, aluminum uh, as soon as I uh, can get up more money. So anyway. Just to show you, this is going to be my workbench. I'll probably do a bunch of videos in here. At least that's the plan. Um, I wanted to see how well it was going to look. So I'm thinking this is going to be pretty good. So, by the way, the door, the opening here, well, um, you yeah, know, the door. Here is uh, at uh, 60 inches. Okay, so that's a good five foot wide door. That's plenty. I'd be able to, if I need to use my table saw, I'll be able to set it up right here and push the wood through. Uh, so that's not a problem at all. And, uh, but I, like I said, I've got two of these coming so that I'm. I can put my uh, some of the other junk in there, I guess, bicycles and such. 
Uh, well, okay. And uh, here it is on the outside. Sort of do a walk around here. Yeah. All right, it's kind of strange. See, this is a 10 by 12, right? Well, I bought two of these for about the same amount of money as you could buy a 10 by 24, which <laughs> seems kind of odd to me, but it's just the way it seemed to work out. But there it is. So yeah, this is my uh, current situation here with uh, my workbench in the house. It's a bit, um, you know, cluttery and everything, but uh, with the shed, I believe I'll be able to organize it um, to where I'll actually be able to make use of this workbench a lot better. This is New Caligon's New Kill Wasp and Hornet Killer. And it says that it reaches 20 feet above the ground. Well, let's give it a try. I just happen to have a wasp nest. It's not much of one, but yet it is. I am about 15 feet away from the wall okay where the wasp nest happens to be here we are new kill now if it actually reaches okay uh, that distance I'll be sold and it let's see thinking it made it no real problems there it is. Okay, it made it. So you can see how it hit the uh, side of the house and everything. But yes, it, it definitely made it. Okay, now I got, I don't know, I don't know if there's any wasps in there, but I got a nest up there. Whoops. Uh, that can't be good. <laughs> yeah I got the nest pretty good but um, I uh, also got my camera but you know saturated but that's okay there you have it new Calgon's new kill